USAID Sustainable Financing for HIV has worked for two years to support Vietnam's efforts to successfully transition the country's HIV program from being donor-funded to being sustainable and locally financed. USAID partnered with the government of Vietnam to provide technical support at the national and provincial levels in five priority provinces. The project achieved significant results by strengthening the Social Health Insurance, or SHI, system's ability to provide HIV services, guiding the implementation of provincial subsidy of premiums and co-payments for HIV patients, ensuring the availability of ARVs through SHI, and contributing to a favorable legal framework. We help successfully integrate all donor-funded HIV outpatient clinics into public health facilities by April 2020. We successfully accelerated the implementation of ARV co-payment subsidy models through provincial funding in five project provinces. Dự án của USF về tài chính bền vững cho chương trình HIV hỗ trợ chúng tôi vận động với chính sách để xin cái kinh phí đồng chi trả điều trị ARV cũng như là cái kinh phí mua thẻ bảo hiểm y tế cho bệnh nhân. With other USAID implementing partners, we worked with the Vietnam Administration of HIV AIDS Control, VAAC, to successfully advocate for local funding for SHI premiums and ARV co-payment in 48 out of 63 provinces nationwide. In March 2019, the government of Vietnam began providing ARVs through SHI. USAID guided provinces on SHI policies and practices related to HIV and ARVs. One example was the SHI Q&A section on Ho Chi Minh City Center for Diseases Control's website. Một uh, hỏi và đáp uh, trên cái website uh, về cái bảo hiểm y tế cho cái người nhiễm HIVS là một cái kênh hỗ trợ kỹ thuật hiệu quả uh, dành cho các cái cơ sở điều trị. Chúng tôi nhận nhận thấy đó là một cái sáng kiến rất là hay uh, có thể là uh, áp dụng ở nhân rộng ở nhiều cái uh, tỉnh thành khác. At the national level USAID tracked SHI contribution for ARVs and other HIV services. The tracking results showed that VAAC exceeded its 2019 targeted number of patients with access to ARVs through SHI. In the first six months of 2020, 63,500 patients were on SHI-covered ARVs, over half of VAAC's target for 2020. USAID Sustainable Financing for HIV helped attain high-level agreement between the Ministry of Health and VSS leaders to endorse adding TLD, a superior drug regimen, to the SHI list. We did this by assessing and sharing evidence of the cost-effectiveness and budget impact of TLD. The project generated compelling evidence to successfully advocate for inclusion of select HIV prevention services into the benefit package of the revised SHI law, which is expected to be approved by the National Assembly in October 2021. To inform policy development, we assessed the first year that ARVs were provided through SHI. We worked with VAAC to revise Circular 28 and Circular 8 regulating the administration of nationally procured ARVs using SHI funds. The project developed a provincial budget estimation tool with VAAC that helped provinces develop sustainable HIV financing plans. Over the last two years, financial access to HIV services has greatly improved. Over 90% of people living with HIV are enrolled in SHI. All HIV facilities are now integrated into the government health system and domestic funding for HIV services has increased to over half of program costs. With assistance from the USAID Sustainable Financing for HIV project, Vietnam has accelerated its progress towards sustainably and domestically financing its HIV response. Although challenges remain, USAID is committed to helping Vietnam achieve its target of becoming an HIV-free nation by 2030.